Hey everybody, welcome to another episode with 801 Collector here. Um, like I said in my last video, I just uploaded. Uh, I've got a couple more things coming, like this right here, which are, was our Dominaria Remastered. Excited for this pack. I'm really hoping, honestly, to get any of the top four hitters, something like that. Force of Will, Vampiric Tutor, uh, Urza's Incubator. I, and last video, I got Sylvan's Library, and I didn't realize how much it was worth. It was the highest one in that thing i believe so that's the funny thing so i kind of hoping for some good hits something cool um and just before i start get started on this and as i am pulling it out um i had what i want to do <clears throat> to bring to you guys attention and get people's ideas and votes and see if they want to do this but essentially i want to start doing battles so what that is going to entail is um in one way shape or form i'm not sure how about it, how i'm going to go about it yet but essentially um I'll put three to four people uh, on this battle. And essentially with this is that, you know, if, if it's a battle of, you know, three people, then, you know, each of them get two packs. And then basically whoever hits the highest amount of mana value out of their rares and, and, and uh, mythics, I'll give away a pack or something like that to that winner. So um, something kind of fun. I would even be willing to do it where... You get to keep the cards that are pulled on that, but there would obviously need to be a cost for that. So if you guys can get people to, to look at this and watch the videos, then then I can start seeing more people and, and getting the value out of it and being able to do that. So hopefully that comes in the future. Anyways, let's start into it. Alrighty, let's see here. That's an odd break. Oh, look at that one. That's fun. Alrighty, not sure how the setup is on this one, so we'll definitely have to see here. Zombie. Oh wow, time stretch. I think that's a decent one. I'm not 100% sure though. I don't think it is. I'm not sure, but it's that retro foil. That's really cool. I really like that. And that is a really nice one. Then a rare, oversold cemetery. Another rare, siege gang, siege gang commander. Not bad. I don't know this pack super well, so I don't know what's the big hits or not. Arborea. Lull. In a, <laughs> that's pretty cool. I actually really like Look at that. Um, oh, we've got some Silvers here. Elvish Spring Guide. Our Mountain. That's cool. Turnabout. Gamekeeper. Failed Serpent. Pacifism. Polluted Mire. Deep Analysis, and Goblin Reddit. I think that's what that said. Anyways, um, yeah, I'm not super super knowledgeable on this this uh, collection at all. Not that I am with any of them, necessarily, but uh, just be prepared that I will be not sure on which ones are hits and which ones aren't. And I just want to double-check something here. I just like to make sure that these all look good because... I've seen some people get scammed, and I just want to make sure that doesn't happen to me. I had a, I can't remember what pack it was, but I, after pulling it, I was like, I felt, something just felt odd. Couldn't put my finger on it, but something felt odd, so not sure. Alrighty, here we go. Rare right off the rip, Denzin the Deep of the Deep. That's a cool looking card. Full, full foil. That's a really cool looking card. I like that look. And then another rare, Gemstone Mine. Then Lieutenant Kirtar, that's a rare. Mythic Urza, Lord High Artist Artificer, that's a good one. It's not bad. I think that's close to ten bucks or something like that. Maybe I don't. I don't know though. That's not bad at all. It's a mythic. Ornith Ornithopter. Yeah, I'm not going to pronounce that right. Wraith. Uh, heir to the Helm, whatever swamp. Spirit Monger. I really like the look of these cards. I don't know why. I just think they look pretty rad. Honestly, so who knows? But man, that Force of Will would be super, super awesome to hit. Or a Vampire Tutor. I really am uh, hoping for one of those, but who knows? I haven't been having a crazy ton of luck lately on big hits, so who knows? Alrighty. Maze of Ith? Ith? Something like that. That's a cool looking card. That's a rare. Mythic. Legacy Weapon. Okay. 
don't know what that's worth or anything like that. Not not holographic. Zer the Enchanter. All right. I think that's a decent card, but I'm not sure. I know I've seen Zer before, but I'm not 100% sure. Phantom. Terror. That's our common. Mog the War Marshal. And then our Island card. I've been doing this all wrong, haven't I? Yes, I have. Thieving Magpie. Dragon Blood. And then all of our other commons here. I've been messing all this up. I turn myself all around, guys. Let me do this or else it's my OCD will kick in. <laughs> Not that it hasn't already, but yes. And then these are just silvers here. So those are golds. And then we got silvers here. I've been backing them up and doing it opposites. If that makes any sense at all. Okay, and then all of our commons. Let's do some more mythics that we got out of this. I think these are all commons as well. Yep. Okay. Let's get our mythics back over here. Okay. Back on track. Whew. Silly, silly. Okay, here we go. Let's see here. So best hit that I've seen that I don't that I know of. This is definitely not concrete. Is the is a high lord art artificer but it's only around 10 bucks so hopefully we got some better stuff going on Rith the awakener it's a rare enlightened tutor all right that's not bad enlightened tutor is not bad yeah that's our best card right there non-holographic non-foil it's around 20 bucks arcade sabbath sabbath yeah lieutenant kurtar Bird Soldier, interesting. Juggernaut, seen this one before. Impulse, Goblin, Land, Sierra Angel, Overmancer, Terror again, Spirit Link. Alrighty. Yeah, I really don't know what we'll see, but that's our now that's our best hit so far, is that Enlightened Tutor, so that's definitely good on on that. I'll take that. Um, at least there's something. Divine Sacrament on a rare. Ward worldly tutor. And I think that's around fifteen bucks. Yeah, it's not bad at all. Okay, there we go. Now Tuco Shade. I don't know about that one. Arcanus the omnip omnipotent recoil. Okay. Let's see we have that. That's the first time we got some um, some commons and not just commons back there. Okay, and then more onto our commons deck there. Alrighty, another token, legacy weapon again. Unfortunate, but. I don't, maybe unless it's worth a lot of money, then that's not unfortunate. But if I got it twice, it can't be worth that much. Mythic Force of Will, let's go, baby! Right there. That is exactly what we needed right there. Force of Will. 60 to 70 bucks right there, baby. Oh, that's awesome. That is exactly what we needed right there. <laughs> oh, no way! It's incubator right after that? <laughs> That's around 30s. That's in the 30s as well. Holy crap, man. Hunting grounds. That is wild. What a pack. Holy crap. Goblin. <laughs> That's wild. Turnabout. That's probably our hit for the pack, which is awesome. But if we get crazy, crazy lucky. I mean, honestly, both those are, are great hits for the entire pack, honestly. Um, versus incubator is a, a great one, so that's like the third best card right there. So that's honestly wild. That is so cool. That is so so cool. Oh my gosh, I gotta put this. And if you guys notice, maybe I I did the I've got a new camera set up where I have a camera in a different location than I did previously. Kind of like it better. Kind of shows my angle of vision. Okay, 
Raiders. What two killer hits. Holy crap. That is uh that is quite the fact right there. But force of will, baby. Finally, I got the best hit you can get in a pack. <laughs> uh, not uh, not stupid expensive, not a mana crypt, but hey, hopefully this doesn't take my luck for tomorrow when I open up, uh, or if I do end up doing the video tomorrow, my uh, Ixalan collector booster box. I really want a mana crypt in there, but we'll see. Okay, of the deep, that's a rare. Word World Gorger Dragon. That is really interesting. I really like the art on that. You guys see that? That's pretty rad art. I like that a lot, actually. Okay, Jester's Cap. No mercy. Okay, that's another mythic, an enchantment. When whenever a creature deals damage to you, destroy it. Holy crap, that's a wild card. That is a wild card. Oh my gosh. Oh, uh, Seer and Commons. And on to our Uncommons, our Island. Storm Entity. Congregate. And then on to our Commons, our last little bit of Commons. That's a wild mythic, honestly. In a black deck, I, I might. If I do my Vampire deck or Death Touch deck, I might do that. If it's not already in it, I might add that to it. One day I'll build that deck, but. I want to do, uh, I always forget his name, Karlov or something like that. And it is about 150 bucks for that card alone. And I just haven't been able to bite the bullet, even though I'm buying these. But anyways, one of these days I'll do it. Okay, here we go. Arcanus the Omnipotent. Okay. Jester's Cap and Full Art. That's really cool. That is, I like the look of that. That's really cool. Birds of Paradise, all right. This is worth, worth a couple bucks. That's not bad at all. Rare, Mind Slicer. Tiana's ship, Ship's Caretaker. Okay, Crusader. And Peregrine Drake. Oh, that's a really cool forest. Wow. That's really cool. Okay. Okay, and then on to our commons. Alrighty, we're well over half, obviously. One, two, three, four. Yeah, so we've got four left here. Um, I really didn't pay that much for this pack, so I think it's going to be pretty easy to get my money back, if not more, especially with hitting Force of Will. So I think that's going to help us out quite a bit. I kind of like the retro frame better than the Big frame, whatever you want to call it. Man, apparently I am weak. Or this pack is stronger than any pack I've seen before. Sheesh. There we go. And now it opens up really nice and easy. Alrighty. Another token. Divine Sacrament. Okay, not bad, not bad. It's rare. Grim Lava Mancer. That's pretty cool. Sulfur Falls. Sulfur Falls engines battlefield tap unless you enter. Okay. Not bad. It's a rare. Cliff Top Retrieval. These land cards. Log the War Marshal. Renewed Faith. Chain Lightning. There's another one of our holographic foil uh, forests that I like. Thran Golem, interesting. And then on to this. Okay, stone. Do, 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 do. Okay. Three more packs, three more packs. All right. I will lose it if I can get, if we get Vampiric Tutor as well on this. That would be insane. <laughs> that would be insane and really, really cool. But let's see what we get here. Okay, Goblin. Arcane of Nipta again. Okay, so I definitely know that that's not worth that much because I just got it again. Helm of the Awakening. Rare. Sierra. Sarah Avatar. That's a mythic. That's not bad at all. That's pretty cool. Uh, not sure if that was a hitter or not. So, Glory. 
vel dupe uncommon for mods crypt lol forest Croesus's catacombs improvised armor wild dog that would do good for that the dog decks that are going out i've been seeing around lately so definitely like secret layers doing their drop right now is dogs and cats and i'm like yeah. I don't really give a crap about that. Okay, gnome. Oversold Cemetery. That's a really cool looking card. That's really cool. I like that. Maze of Ith? Ith? Yeah, I think that's Ith. I think we got this, but not in the full uh, art treatment. Sephiric Vortex. Crawl space. I see manipulator. These older looking cards are kind of cool. I don't, me being newer to magic in general, it's kind of cool to see these retro frame looking things. Zombie infestation, elvish spirit guide, and then on to our commons. Okay. Last pack, y'all. Let's hope. Crazy, crazier things have happened. Not to me, but, you know, in the world. But here we go. Alrighty. Trisk, Tris, Triskelion? Triskelion? I knew how to talk, you know? Okay, it's an un... Wait, is that a... Oh, yeah, okay, that's a rare. Wrath of God. That's a cool one. I like to look at that card. Not foil though. Arborea. Pyre Zombie. Impulse. Oh, well, commons out of this. Terra we've gotten that one. Okay. That looks like that's about it. Um, I don't know all the hits, but I do know these two, and these two are great hits. <laughs> I can't believe that. Um, Urza's Incubator, I really like that. I might end up putting that in one of my decks. Um, and then as well as the Sports Wheel is actually really good as well. So um, thank you guys so much for watching. Again, please let me know in the comments down below uh, if something like battles or whatnot would be something that you guys would enjoy doing, uh, whether it be the free version where I just – mail out the pack to the winner or if you guys want to keep all of them i can uh do a purchase price if you have any questions let me know i'm happy to answer anything um but other than that thank you so much for watching and you guys have a great day Bye bye